Hey, so excited, it's Monday. I uh, just got my new office in a fantastic building in the heart of Richmond Hill. So looking really, uh, really forward to meeting some clients and building my team, helping my associates. Here it's uh, Valentine's Day. So if you're looking for some great flowers, make sure you check out Sobeys up in Richmond Hill. One for my daughter, one for my son, and a big one for my wife. Well, it's early, early Thursday morning, going to meet a, a fantastic commercial uh, client of mine who's actually a friend. Uh, is looking at actually uh, leasing out a storefront uh, to kind of run his business. So uh, getting started early in the morning. Here we are, Home Depot. Just going to get a client gift. They move in tomorrow. So just want to make sure that they, uh, they're set up uh, with a nice Home Depot gift card to get everything that they need for their brand new home. We're just standing inside of a, a brand new home that my clients are going to be moving into in about a day's time. Uh, I'm going to be meeting them right now and one of the things that I always do is 24 hours before any one of my clients take possession of a new property, we do a final walkthrough, the final buyer's visit. And really this is an opportunity for me to make sure that all of the items in the home are as they were when we purchased the property. So. Hey everyone, Steve Kim here. It's a Friday morning, just uh, heading downtown to meet a, a client of mine. Uh, who's looking at potentially investing in some properties, but anyways made it it's 9 30 in the morning on a Friday So excited so I met with a great uh, great new client of mine within the first like 10 minutes. He was like, you know um, You're not like other realtors and then he alluded to the fact that that I wasn't pushy you look I predicate my business on giving people advice I wouldn't advise you to do something if I personally would not do it myself. You gotta guide people. You have to inform people on what would be the best decision for them, whether they're purchasing a property or whether whether they're investing. Look, it's being patient, right? It's not about you know going after the transaction. And I tell this to a lot of people. What you should fight to do is you should fight to go after that relationship. Uh, and that's, look, that's what's really helped me in my business. It's always tricky going to see properties when the uh, the stairs aren't shoveled. Car Carlo, you made it okay? <laughs> okay, here we go. The toe dig is what you need to do. 